Hey guys, Mr. Hatch live from the parents' basement. Um, so I guess I just got a few quick updates for you guys today. Um, so we're starting to finalize what we're calling our remote learning plan, uh, which is basically just uh, a list of our ideas for how to make remote learning actually work during this whole thing. So we had a big meeting yesterday, like me and all the admin and all the other teachers and stuff. And I don't think anything is completely finalized yet, but we have a pretty good idea of how the next few weeks, um, at the very least, are going to are gonna look. So the thing that you guys probably want to know the most is how you're being graded. And uh, my understanding is that you're mostly being graded on participation from now on. Um, so the things you do, they actually do matter. Please do do them. Um, at the very least, it gives you something to do, something to keep you engaged. Um, as of next week, I'm gonna look into doing like actual like Zoom classes where um, we'll hold like, you know, online class and we'll be there virtually. Um, I appreciate the responses you guys gave me in the uh, Google Forms. Um, I'll use that data I was looking at earlier this morning. I'll use that data to help me try to plan like what I'm gonna do and uh, how to keep you guys like informed. Um, so yeah, these things do matter. Um, you will be graded on them, although, like I said, it'll be mostly on participation, although I, I don't think it's going to be entirely. So you can't just, like, you know, write two sentences for whatever I ask for and still expect to um, to do super well. But, um, yeah, the way, the way it's being explained right now is that for the most part, you won't be able to bring your grade down because of these things, although you might get a, a no credit for fourth quarter. Um, but if you just do, like, just put in some effort, do what's being asked, and uh, you should do really well, actually. Um, yeah, that's, I guess that's the main thing. Um, a lot of you guys have articles to read today. Um, I, I hope you guys will like them. I think they're okay. I think they're kind of interesting to think about. Um, yeah, actually, I don't know how much more I have to really say. Oh, I got, my haircut was uh, cleaned up a little bit. By, uh, by my mom, actually. My mom and my dad helped me finish it up. Um, so yeah, I look less like a mushroom now, so that's nice. Anyways, um, it's a Thursday. Thursday means tickets. So, here we are. Oh, today has been a tough one, folks. I don't know about you guys, but this is starting to get to me. Period one, Brit Lit. Let's see what we got. The winner is, I can't even read that in this light. Uh, it is, ha, it's Brad. Congrats, Brad. Enjoy your big day. Period three, AP Lang. Our big winner is, it is Summer Simpson. Man, Summer, I, I, man, did you rig these? It's not, that's not okay. That's, that's, that's academically dishonest. <laughs> Enjoy your day, Summer. Then we have, for our third winner, this is from Second Period Honors, our winner is Riley McGarry. Congrats, Riley. Enjoy the big day. And finally, this is my last period English class, 10th graders, we have that is Carly. Congrats, Carly. All right. I've got a stack of boxes now. Look at that. Yeah, I'm destructive. Get used to it. Um, <laughs> and finally, the saddest graph whoever lived, you see it? It's actually starting to go up. I hope, I hope.